Microsoft and Amazon could be in hot water over apparently making it difficult for UK customers to use multiple suppliers of vital cloud services. The Competition and Markets Authority CMA, the country's antitrust regulator, said Thursday it was launching an investigation into the UK cloud infrastructure services market to determine whether players were engaged in anti-competitive practices. Cloud computing firms, such as Microsoft and Amazon Web Services AWS, use data centers around the world to provide remote access to computing services and storage. This cloud infrastructure forms the foundation for how software applications, such as Gmail and Dropbox, are developed and run. The CMA probe has been initiated following a report from Britain's media and communications regulator Ofcom, which found that the supply of cloud infrastructure in the United Kingdom is highly concentrated and competition limited. We welcome Ofcom's referral of public cloud infrastructure services to us for in-depth scrutiny, CMA CEO Sarah Cardell said in a statement. This is a £7.5 billion market that underpins a whole host of online services from social media to artificial intelligence foundation models. Many businesses now completely rely on cloud services, making effective in this market essential. According to Ofcom, last year Microsoft and AWS had a combined market share of 70 to 80 percent in the UK cloud infrastructure services market. Google is their closest competitor with a share of 5 to 10 percent. Both Amazon and Microsoft said they would engage constructively with the CMA. But a spokesperson for AWS added that the company disagreed with Ofcom's findings. We believe they are based on a fundamental misconception of how the IT sector functions and the services and discounts on offer, the spokesperson said, noting that the cloud has made switching between providers easier than ever. A spokesperson for Microsoft added, We are committed to ensuring the UK cloud industry remains innovative, highly competitive and an accelerator for growth across the economy.